Have you ever wondered what truly lies deep beneath the waves? Just 20 meters below the surface, we've only seen 2% of the ocean's true depth. As we descend, the world we find is beyond imagination. Passing 200 meters, we enter the twilight zone. Here, sunlight gives way to shadow. Sharks hunt in the gloom, and other creatures like squid must create their own light. Bioluminescence is the language of survival in this place, making it feel less like an ocean and more like an alien galaxy. At 1,000 meters, we are in the midnight zone, a realm of total, permanent blackness. The pressure is crushing. Imagine the weight of 50 jumbo jets or over 1,500 elephants pressing down on you. Yet, even here, life thrives. This is the home of the giant squid and the eerie anglerfish, luring prey with its own glowing beacon. At 4,000 meters, we reach the abyssal zone. It's a vast, frozen plain, a graveyard of ships. Here, the wreck of the Titanic has been resting in absolute silence since 1912. Descending to 6,000 meters, we enter the Hadal zone, named after the mythological underworld. Life here doesn't rely on the sun. It clusters around scalding, mineral-rich volcanic vents, drawing energy from the Earth's core. These organisms have evolved not just to exist, but to flourish in conditions that would be instantly lethal to surface life. Finally, we reach the deepest point on our planet, the Mariana Trench. At 10,000 meters down, this chasm is so profound that if you placed Mount Everest inside, its peak would still be submerged under more than a kilometer of water. To put that in perspective, 10 kilometers is the altitude where commercial jets fly. But here, it's a world of crushing pressure beneath an ocean, not a sky. It's a strange fact. We have better maps of the surface of Mars than we do of our own ocean floor. Every new expedition into the deep reveals something new, and perhaps the most incredible discoveries on our planet are still waiting for us in the dark. Which ocean zone fascinates you the most, and why? Share your opinions in the comments and join the conversation.